Hey, Eric, sorry to take so long to get back to you. Um, so if you were going to factor this one, I believe it's 4x squared minus 20x plus 25. So you would put, ooh, sorry, I'm doing this without a slate, 4x squared in the top left-hand corner, and then you'd put the 25 in the bottom right. So you'd have your 25 here, and then multiply these two together. And so you'd have 100x squared. And so what you're looking for is two numbers that multiply to 100x squared that also add to negative 20x. And so that would be negative 10x and negative 10x. So negative 10x and negative 10x. And um, then all you have to do is just find the common factor, the greatest common factor for each row in each column. So if we were looking at this one here, the greatest common factor here would be 2x. And so then that would come out here. And the greatest common factor here, you have to take that negative out with this, otherwise your signs won't be right. So that would be negative 5. And then you do the same thing up here. So it's basically going to be the same thing because you've got the same thing on the corners here. So GCF between 4x squared and negative 10x would be 2x. And the GCF between negative 10x and positive 25 would be negative 5. And so then the factors that you would have would be 2x minus 5. And you can either do that again or you can square this one. So it would look like this.